In this video, I'm going to share a quick tip for renaming and working with Excel tables. So the tip is that you can add the table name box to the quick access toolbar. As you can see here in my quick access toolbar, I have this table name box right here. This displays the name of the table that I'm currently working with. And you can also rename the table here. So if I just wanted to click in here, I can rename the table. Maybe this is for a specific region. Just rename the table and hit enter. And that renames my table. So the nice part about this is, is that you don't have to navigate over to the table design tab. So typically when you select a cell inside the table, the table design tab appears right here. And of course you can click here and then jump over here. And this is the table name box where you can rename the table. But the nice part about having the quick access toolbar, like I mentioned, is you don't have to navigate over to this box. So in order to add this here, I'll go ahead and uh, first remove it and then we'll re-add it. In order to add it, the first thing you want to do is just select a cell inside a table, go to the table design tab, and then you're going to right click right here where it says table name. Anywhere where it says table name above the box, right click and choose add to quick access toolbar. And that's going to add the table name box here to the quick access toolbar. Now you'll also notice when you click outside of a table, that name uh, or the box just appears blank and you can't click inside of it. And it's only when you uh, click in a table that it is enabled and then you can modify it. Also works on sheets that have multiple tables, of course. So this sheet has multiple tables. I'm currently in this table and I can easily see that. I can click outside of it and then click in this table or click between the tables to easily see the name of the table that I'm currently working with. One other shortcut there for viewing the name of the table is if you do have a cell selected in the table, you can hit control A on the keyboard. That'll select all the cells inside the data body range of the table. And then the table name will appear here in the name box. Now you can't really rename it from here and uh, or you also have to select the entire table to uh, see the table name, but it is another way to see the table name outside of the table design tab. And one bonus tip or shortcut for renaming tables is the keyboard shortcut on Windows, which is Alt J T A. So press and release the Alt key J T and then A, and that will uh, select the table name box here in the design tab and also select the table name. Now those uh, that particular shortcut is easy for me to remember because those happen to be my initials for my name J T A. Uh, but if that's uh, hard for you to remember, then put the uh, table name box up here in the quick access toolbar. And you can also create a keyboard shortcut for that, depending on the position that the quick access or the button is in in the quick access toolbar. So press and release Alt, and I have it in the ninth position. So Alt 9 will be my keyboard shortcut there to again rename my table and select all the text there within the table name. Now, one potential slight advantage that the table design tab has in the name box here is that it is wider. So if you have a really long table name, You'll be able to read more of it here in this table name box versus the one in the quick access toolbar. I haven't figured out a way to make that any wider, the box here in the quick access toolbar. But again, it's a great way to just see your table names when you're working with tables and writing formulas. So I hope those tips help you. Of course, if you have any additional tips or suggestions or questions, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks again for watching. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next video.